It is a beast, this, isn't it? It's the enormity of it. So we'll take it one mile at a time now. In 2015, eight strangers went into a tent in the desert for the Marathon de Saab and we became friends. We got an email out of the blue from Sam, who was one of our tent mates. He'd been diagnosed with bowel cancer. And I wanted to do something to say, look, your tent mates are still with you. We're right behind you and we, we support you. I sent an email saying, did you know guys that the Thames is 184 miles long? Does anybody want to come and run it? Within about five minutes, Fab had come back and said, I'll do it. Bex came back, you know, within the day. It's 184 miles over three days. This is a step into the unknown for all of us. I don't think I've been as intimidated by a distance. It was stunning for the first 40 or 50 miles. And then when night came, it got difficult, it got very difficult. Shower, shower. Yeah, they're loving it. Get it done now. It was long. Get it done at 60 miles is different to get it done at 71 miles. That wasn't the plan. It made me think that tomorrow is going to be very difficult. I'm OK, I think. Let's see tomorrow. Fab woke up and his stomach was in pieces. You know, he managed to force down some porridge, but he wasn't right. Stomach's flipping. I think after about five miles, he decided to go home and try and get better. You know, when someone sort of goes, then it kind of demoralises you a little bit. So is a little seed of doubt in your head if one person has quit, whether or not now it's OK for you to quit. We're both plodding along. I was worried. You know, I didn't want to be out there all day again. But then, obviously, Andy came along and just lifted our spirits. and. Three hours passed if it was nothing. He kick-started us. He got us out there and going at a time when we were really low, so it was really important. Uh, another friend of mine, Adam, brought his two daughters out. Sam. Hey, man. How are you? You all right, buddy? To have him there oh, so actually made today really special. I made it feel like um, what we were doing for the purpose. 12 hours to do 54 miles, so that's two marathons in a bit. We moved brilliantly today. From time to time, I was looking down the watch and I was thinking we're, we're going too fast. Which is amazing because you've got you've got no right to be running that quick. It was it was a lot easier today. Like when Richard came along and helped us out, and then your dentist as well. Epic shit goodies for Mr. Alga currently running the length of the River Thames. Running through the crowds of London was a little bit tricky, I, I would say. There was some like crazy lunatic that likes running yeah. with a, a rucksack on and two bottles. I'm happy to see that thing. Coming around that corner to see that was special. We've done it, finally. There were, there were definitely moments that I didn't think we were going to... Well, yesterday morning, yeah, yeah. I thought we pulled through. We made it to the end.